We are your home theater and AV questions answered. This is AV Rant. Want your home theater or AV question answered by Tom and Rob? Send it to question at avrant.com. Welcome to AV Rant. I'm Tom Antry and I'm here with Rob H. All right, just Jay. Just Jay? That's, That's a, what he wants to be called. I don't think just you, Jay. you don't get to name yourself, Jay. That's not the way that works. <laughs> I'm, I'm not doing that. All right. Jay says, should Atmos ceiling speakers be pointed straight down towards the floor or be aimed at the listening position and why? Now, the answer to this question is, of course, uh, not as straightforward as you would probably like yeah. it to be. But the answer is straight down. That's what there's design, That's what that, the idea is. But That's what Dolby will tell that's you. That's what Dolby will tell you. But that's assuming that your speakers are fairly have a wide dispersion pattern and are fairly diffuse okay because that's the whole idea right which yeah. you if you have a very directional speaker or if it's not optimally placed you're going to start thinking you should aim it and you would be correct that's what you will have, that's what you should do <laughs> you know yeah. so you know i mean the, think about the elevation speakers from SVS right should those mm-hmm. be should those be pointed straight down no because they're they're not placed where they should be placed. They're placed off to the sides. So they have to be angled downwards uh, to get them so the sound's coming towards where it should be coming towards. If you have a speaker that's more directional in your ceiling, you may want to angle it. Or if it's outside of the recommended uh, degrees of where it's supposed to be placed, mm. you might want to aim it. Or yeah. if it's, you know, I mean, there's all sorts of reasons why you'd want to. But... The answer is it should be pointed straight down. Asterix. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dol- Dolby's official answer is uh, uh, if you're using an in ceiling or an on ceiling speaker, they want you to use one that has 90 degree dispersion in every direction. Yeah. All right. So uh, and like honestly, a, a lot of in ceiling speakers are kind of designed that way. I mean, oh, sure. yeah. that's, that's I mean, kind the of their idea. Are. The idea yeah. is that's supposed to be filling a whole home audio sort of thing. So it's not an unreasonable ask. It's not yeah. them thinking that you have to go out there and buy some high end speakers. They're saying that's what most of them do. So mm-hmm. just get something. Don't get something weird. But, you know, you might get something weird. <laughs> if you get something yeah. weird, you're going to have to deal with it. And if, if that's what you have, is this very wide dispersion in ceiling or on ceiling speaker, then Dolby says, aim it straight down because the idea is they don't want any one seat in particular to be getting a direct sound while the rest of the seats are getting an indirect sound. Right. They want all the seats to be getting an indirect sound. That's actually their goal. And that's why they still recommend most highly top fronts and top rears, neither of which is aiming directly at any seat. That's the idea. So the idea is every seat in the theater is getting an off axis sound so that none of them are getting a clearly more direct sound than any other seat. That's sort of the idea. But if you have a speaker that doesn't have this very wide, even dispersion, then you're going to need to aim it a little bit. Uh, you know, the, the golden ear speakers are a perfect example because they're using this folded ribbon tweeter that doesn't have tremendously uh, wide vertical dispersion. So if you tried to cover the whole seating area with that, it might not work. There might be seats that get, you know, very reduced high frequency output. So you'll want to angle the speaker a little bit so that the yeah. what you're aiming for is the seats to all fit within the even dispersion of whatever speaker you're using. Ultimately, that's your goal. So uh, whatever it takes to do that, that's, that's what you want to do. Do that. Want your question answered? Send it to question at avrant.com. AV Rant. Now go out and listen to something.